What is going on guys? So it's been a little while since I posted a video last. Um, I'll get into why when I got in the water, but um, today we were at the quarry. I don't really have a plan. Um, it's super windy, so I think I'll be throwing a chatter bait, maybe a spinner bait, and uh, hopefully get into some fish. So yeah, let's go. Like I said, chatterbait first, black and blue. Guggenbait's trailer. Um, it's a bit windier than I uh, was hoping for out here. We're gonna try to deal with it. Feels weird casting. Feels weird being on the kayak again. It's been like a, I feel like a month already since I've been on this thing. Move up a little bit. Gonna get blown around today. Eight hours later. for freaking I don't know how long I was about to give up and then uh, so I was throwing the drop shot over here that just slid right out right there and got this decent fish this is the second fish of the day I think it's been maybe three hours now something like that snapped the rod um hooked into this guy this is a decent fish I haven't caught one of these in a little while he's pulling pretty pretty hard so uh, pretty psyched to be back on the bass hell yeah Thanks, buddy. Let's get this all untangled now. That's the biggest bass for sure that I've ever caught on a drop shot. It's usually little squeakers like the first one that I caught. I haven't really been talking on the ca or haven't really been talking to the camera because things have been super slow. Um, so this might be kind of an odd video, I think. <laughs> Not much talking, like I said, and then uh, that just happened, so. Yeah, I was just getting ready to leave. My car is like literally right behind me. Um, I guess I could talk about why I haven't filmed in a little while since uh, I just caught that fish. And that is because um, I was going after salmon for a little while up in Wisconsin. I'll put some clips in right here. No problem. I need the fish over here, man. You guys look at this spot. Yeah, I got 
Yeah. Oh, it came off. Maybe not. Yeah, it came off. Oh. I unfortunately didn't catch any. I hooked into a couple um, really good ones, but they always broke me off. So, um, yeah, that was a bust. It rained for like a week straight, so I couldn't fish then. And then also, I started a new job last week, so, and um, just been tired and not really looking to fish after work. So, it feels good to be back on the kayak. And fishing again, oh, like I said, I snapped my mojo rod, trying to get it, get a uh, chatterbait untangled. See, there's the tip right there. Here's the actual tip right here. So hopefully I get that replaced. I'm not sure how that works out. I might have to go to Bass Pro and try to fight with them, see if they'll replace it or not. I think I have like the warranty for that. And then, uh, yes, yeah, hopefully they replace that. Let me get a couple more casts over here drop shot and yeah hoping to get at least one more today two fish down all right guys so that's it two fish for the day this might be kind of an odd video because I wasn't really expecting to be able to make a video because I didn't catch fish all day up until right here next to the boat ramp so yeah two fish on the drop shot the camera angle was all zoomed in I felt like a freaking amateur today I snapped the rod just uh, rough day out here it's getting super windy and yeah, um, that's it for today. I'll check you guys in the next video. Later.